Well, next, the music industry is just one that's been devastated by the impact of COVID-19. With entertainment venues closed and audiences locked down, many musicians have taken a hit on their incomes. But there is a lifeline for some at a community-owned pub in Newcastle. Rachel Sweeney reports. <laughs> may be closed, but the curtains are very much open for live shows at the Globe in Newcastle. The Abbey Finn Trio is a jazz group, regularly booked across the North East. They were left devastated when they had nine months worth of work cancelled in 24 hours. We were just sat there and I was just looking at my emails and sort of thing and all these emails, these cancellations are coming through and then I was like, oh, this is like serious. You know, we've worked for, for so many years on, you know, honing our musical craft um, and to, to have that possibly, you know, taken away in the form of lockdown, it wasn't, it wasn't very nice. But the group held on, filling their empty schedule with virtual gigs. We can still engage with audiences that we would usually engage with and audiences further afield. The venue is now broadcasting 15 events a month, everything from classical to rock. They've live streamed 100 gigs since the start of the pandemic. Sometimes things go from bad to worse, more than sometimes. This is Tommy. He was worried he'd have to give up music altogether and look for another line of work. Apart from music, all I've done is bar work and then if there's no bars, there's no hospitality. Probably better for my bank balance, but not so good for the soul. You know. It certainly wouldn't have made me happy. <laughs> but he's still smiling and thanks to Livestream, he's even managed to perform his first ever headline show. So far, £40,000 has been raised through ticket sales. Musicians that have come and done live streams here, maybe for the first time, have been really surprised by how many people tune in, how, many, how, much, how much money they get from the ticket sales, and you know how, how good it looks on the stage and how much like a real gig it can almost feel. So much so that live streaming will continue even when COVID restrictions are lifted. I'd like to see full rooms again of people. Maybe it's opened up a whole new element of uh, watching live music that we hadn't even thought of before. The way we view it may be changing, but the North East's love of music, well, that will never change. Rachel Sweeney, ITV News, Newcastle. No, it won't.